Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and I've been on an archer kick lately, even though I hate archers in Oblivion. So we're going to go over another archer type. Now, last time I did the magic archer, but this time we're going to do the buff archer. The archer that is literally, basically a guard. That's what guards are in Oblivion, is just a hybrid mix of, like, bowmanship and swordsmanship. Because if you also notice, it's really, really freaking hard to battle a guard and knock a guard down. <laughs> which means they have a lot of agility. Which means their bows do a lot of damage. So we're gonna get into a, this. Now the skills for this one are interesting. First of all, you need marksman and some kind of swordsmanship. Or blunt weapon. So marksman, then you need a blade or blunt. blunt. Then heavy armor, because you're gonna be a buff archer. You gotta stick with the theme. Armorer for repairing all the equipment. Now, we have three skills left, right? To combine the buffness and the archerness, buff means you have a lot of health, so you're gonna pop in restoration on that. You got two left, very simple. Block and acrobatics. You are going to be the best physical damage dealer in all areas of everything. By the way, if you don't want a sword, you could always pick hand to hand, but... I mean, sword, or a mace even. So, with this character, right, and by the way, for your, you're going to either pick a com, you're going to pick combat focus, and then you're going to pick agility and endurance for your skills, and for your sign, you're going to pick the warrior because he's badass looking, and also gives you lots of buff skills. So with this character, you're going to use your archery ship to basically jump around and damage people, and then... Go in there and slay with the sword. That's all you're going to do. That is literally all you're going to do. Is You know, remember how Oblivion arms you with basically no magic, and then it arms you with a bow and then a weapon? You're just going to do that. You're going to act exactly like a guard who has healing spells. Just run around, slash everyone. You're going to be able to carry a lot of crap, so you're going to be rich really fast. And... You're going to be able to have an enchanted bow, an enchanted sword. You can do some crazy stuff with this character. I mean, you can literally put silence on the bow to silence mages and then force them to use a dagger against you when you're trained with a sword. Or a mace, if you're a mace person. Like, this is the ultimate combat class. I would almost say if you wanted to make it more combative, get rid of armorer because it's a, pa it's a very passive skill, and put destruction on. And just make a make literally the hybrid class of combat. Just completely wreck house. Because if you're going to make a buff archer, it's at the point where you're just going to be slaying everyone. You're going to be destroying everything in your path. You have two ways of destroying stuff. Three of you get rid of armor and put on destruction. So why would you want to play the game any other way? Screw sneaking around. Okay, you're in heavy armor and have multiple ways to kill people. I mean, if you're even trained in block, you can block and disarm them maybe. Right? You have master marksmanship. You could paralyze people. You can slow, you freaking aim and slow down. Acrobatics, which I believe is either, acrobatics gives you the dodging skill. And then the sword shit, all the paralyzing and disarming you do with a sword, too. You are the ultimate killer. When it comes to mages and they have a bunch of protect, that's, that's not going to be a big deal. Because protect, if you have high enough damage, protect doesn't matter. And if you can take a crap ton of hits, and it doesn't matter. Then if you just put silence on your bow and just pluck them with a silent arrow. Did I mention that silence is, is a necessity if you do a physical character? Yeah. If you guys couldn't figure that out, silence is a necessity. So that's what you're going to do with this character. The buff archer. The archer that decided they also wanted to train with a sword. Basically, the guard class. But with a cooler name. So if you enjoyed this episode, you can tell me in the comments below. If you want to see some tutorials on different types of characters, you can tell me that as well. Because I'm smart enough at coming up with characters. Because I've played Oblivion a lot. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I will see you in the next episode of Stream Vlog or Steam It Post. Whatever I decide to make.